Hello everyone and welcome to the Apologia Online Academy. My name is Mr. Dan Martin and I am the instructor for exploring creation with chemistry. I currently live up in Madison, Wisconsin with my wife Allison, my son Gideon, and my dog Sherlock. My background is in biochemistry. I obtained my bachelor's and my master's from Purdue University and I've been teaching since 2014. And I love talking about science. Science should be interesting and fascinating to really everyone. And that's because, well, chemistry surrounds us. It's everywhere. It runs this beautifully created universe that we live in. Science is not boring. It describes so many of the underlying mechanisms that we observe well every day whether we're driving behind a salt truck which is spreading salt which lowers the melting point of snow we're sitting around a crackling campfire that is undergoing the process of combustion we've just maybe cracked open a bottle of soda and we are watching carbon dioxide rise up and leave solution or maybe we're observing some old machinery around our property or on a field trip that has undergone oxidation and has rusted. These things surround us. Chemistry explains how our created universe functions and I love to bring that excitement to students as they learn about this subject for the first time. So what does the Apologia Online Academy offer that's unique exactly? Well, first and foremost, the Apologia Online Academy is a lecturing service. Once a week, students meet online in live lectures with me for 90 minutes to talk about what they've read already and expand upon it. I love to tell stories and talk through metaphor to help students wrap their minds around more abstract concepts, things that are really challenging to understand maybe on first read. Registration also includes access to an online course portal where students find their access to the live lectures, as well as a location to turn in all of their assigned work and discussion boards to interact with me outside of class as well as their classmates. The Academy provides students accountability. These courses are on a calendar, so assignments have deadlines. With that said, all exams, as well as a special formal laboratory report assignment, are graded by the experts at the Academy. Either an expert teaching assistant or myself read all the things that the students turn in and provide written feedback to them so they can better themselves and their comprehension, and they can do better if they've struggled with something through that feedback. The Formal laboratory reports help to develop students' scientific writing, many of which are for the first time. So students go through a drafting process with our teaching assistant and myself in pr better preparing their scientific writing. And of course, I'm available for questions, both in class, whether students type that question live or they ask it on the mic, I'm happy to assist them in the moment during lecture. This is, in fact, encouraged, whether it's an on-topic question or a curiosity related to what we're currently discussing. Outside of class, I'm available both by email and on the discussion board. When a student has a question, I, question I'm happy to answer that through typing a reply, or if it's a more complex question, recording a video kind of like this one with a whiteboard and some examples to help the student step through those problems. Now, we of course know that science is not boring. Science explains our created universe and how it functions. And I think this is important for success in chemistry, and which is why I put so much focus on making connections to this created universe as we learn something that, at a surface level, is seemingly uncreated. It actually is. So in order to succeed in chemistry, because we of course know chemistry is not necessarily the easiest class that students will take. It's in fact the reason that I became an instructor. I had to work really hard for that B that I earned when I took high school chemistry. And that drove me to do better and learn how to explain things more clearly. It is important that all students who take this course, whether it's with me or someone else, that they do some reading and some work before they attend class. 
that allows them to get over the hurdle of learning the easy things on their own, the more simplistic things like definitions, so that we can then spend our class time focused on the more abstract, complex ideas, or looking at things like calculations, which are a traditional struggle. The course and the curriculum in general also provides hands-on what we kind of call kitchen experiments. And these are experiments that reinforce what you've read about and heard about during lecture. They use materials that are found around your house already or are easily purchased from a local store. These experiments help students see with their own eyes, their senses, what they've already learned about and reinforce those things. This is important for us as humans to observe things for ourselves and not just hear about them. And of course, significance through practice, practice, practice is really important independently and on their own. Chemistry is best learned through seeing example problems and doing as many of them as you can. And of course, asking questions if something's not making sense. So all of this is done with my oversight. I love interacting with students. We have fun in this class. We do have the goal of learning everything, but I like to remain accessible for questions. And I never like students to be intimidated by this course. These are exciting things, folks. Science surrounds us. Your students know this already, whether they recognize it or not. And I hope to see many of you in the fall during registration. So I obviously could not talk about everything during this short video, but I want to make myself accessible to you. If you have any questions or reservations, please use the email down below and I would be happy to assist you. And again, I hope to see a bunch of you in the fall so that we can learn more about the underlying mechanisms of this beautiful created universe.